music, an aesthetically pleasing sound composed of rhythm, melody, and harmony. For the duration of its existence, music has been known to influence, inspire, and shape people's views. Beginning in the 9th century, classical music has lost much of its popularity, and it definitely seems that way in Hawaii. For years now, the Honolulu Symphony has been struggling financially. Even with sold-out crowds for eight of its last ten seasons and several private donations and grants, the Honolulu Symphony cannot make ends meet. The symphony provides many great services and values to the state of Hawaii, but does the public know about the symphony's benefits? What do you know about the Honolulu Symphony? Nothing. I enjoy it, but I don't know very much about it. Um. I really don't know that much about it. I do not know much about the Honolulu Symphony. Uh, I don't know all that much about the symphony. I know nothing. I think they're struggling for money, but I'm not sure. Founded in a punch bowl clubhouse in 1900, the Honolulu Symphony has been a vital component of Hawaii's local culture. As the oldest symphony orchestra west of the Rocky Mountains, the Honolulu Symphony has provided over a century of local service. Unfortunately, the symphony has fallen into a nearly $2 million debt from its last season. The symphony's world-class musicians are over 14 weeks behind payroll. The symphony has already lost 12 of its musicians. Most major orchestras, in order to exist, have an endowment, which helps to keep them uh, operating. And because ticket prices are, are just not large enough to, to pay for all their expenses, and if you raise ticket prices, you're going to put yourself out of business. How would you feel if the Honolulu Symphony did not return to Hawaii? I think that would be really bad. I think the symphony adds a lot to our local culture, and it would be a shame if, if we didn't have a symphony anymore. Very sad. That sucks. Wait, I didn't even know that. I just feel music deprived, that there's that much less music in Hawaii. It will be really bad because a lot of schools and communities would lose their musicians and music teachers. The Honolulu Symphony provides an abundance of wonderful music resources to Hawaii's youth. Many of Hawaii's students look up to the symphony's musicians as mentors, leaders, and teachers. Therefore, the Honolulu Symphony provides Hawaii not only an orchestra with a century of local history, but a great service to Hawaii's future. Music education provides a wonderful basis upon which we can build a future for Hawaii's youth. To lose the Honolulu Symphony would be to lose one of Hawaii's greatest assets, not to mention countless music education programs in Hawaii schools. Enrollment speaks for itself. With so many students, it's a, um, a co-curricular class that students choose. So I think the enrollment speaks that they're, they're into what they play. The, um, we can access music of all, um, all genres and all eras. They want to learn the classics also, the, the, rich, the rich music that has lived for three, three or four hundred years. It's like the great artwork or um, great architecture to, to learn from our past and experience that and learn about it. The benefits of classical music to children are immeasurable. Spatial, reasoning, vocabulary, language, problem solving, and cultural skills are improved in musicians. Also, music teaches kids to work together in order to obtain a common goal. The discipline required to make the music sound presentable is immense, and it results in vast self-expression. But not only does a child make significant gains in the classroom due to their exposure to music, but they also climb the ropes in physical feats as well. The area of the brain that pertains to physical coordination is advanced in early musicians than in non-musicians. Students with musical training are more prone to perform well in physical activity. The Honolulu Symphony promotes music training for the youth in order to ensure a positive outlet and influence for our children. Yes! People are not attracted to um, the type of programs and the, the symphony itself. The educational programs that the symphony does helps keep them uh, alive and it helps build audiences, uh, educating the, the young people and at the same time focusing on uh, music education so that people won't forget about this type of music. Music has always been a part of my life. I've always liked 
to play music, I always like to listen to music. A sense of time and rhythm. More of, I guess, kind of a discipline to practice and dedication to your instrument. I think it's a necessity because, like, every pretty, every mostly most things you do, you make a noise. Like when I walk, I make noise. When I clap, I make noise. And the noise can be transposed into music. Any little thing you do, it has like some musical quality to it. And to me, music is a necessity because without it, I think I'd die. Not literally, but I mean like emotionally inside. The kids of Hawaii aren't the only ones who are benefiting from the Honolulu Symphony. Every symphony performance boosts Hawaii's local economy. These performances cause a ripple effect among the community. For example, a family that attends a performance buys its favorite musician flowers. That same family goes out to eat dinner afterwards, bringing business to a restaurant. Over $6 million are added to Hawaii's local economy each year. So the Honolulu Symphony affects each and every citizen of Hawaii. There are many simple things you can do to help the Honolulu Symphony. First of all, buy symphony tickets or offer donations to their noble cause. Sign your kids up for private music lessons in order to help the individual musicians sustain themselves in Hawaii. While classical music may not be the most popular genre, it is nevertheless vital to the creation of all music. Most importantly, care about the Honolulu Symphony and spread the word. This important asset to Hawaii needs to be sustained in order to be true to Hawaii's culture. What the future holds for the Honolulu Symphony is unknown, but together we can save this legacy.